what is up you guys it is me cutesy and in today's video we are going to be talking about the latest overlook bay tea in today's video we're going to talk about the fishing update a boat week four of the halloween event and some other fun stuff along the way let's get started the first thing i want to show you guys is this wonderwork studios tweeted out a huge new fishing update is coming soon to overlook bay like this tweet if you're excited more tea coming soon and we could see this fish right here he's actually kind of scary i'm not gonna lie look at those teeth those things are huge they're kind of scary he's got a lot of teeth and he's eating a smaller fish like what no this poor little fishy i hope he could get away there's this is really cool okay there's like a bunch of bubbles around him i'm not sure what this is maybe this giant fish is trying to get this little guy he's trying to swim away i wonder what this has to do with this update like hmm what could they add to fishing? It's already such a fun thing in the game. So I'm really excited to see what they do with this, you guys. I am so excited. Another thing I wanna talk to you guys about that I totally forgot to mention last time is this. Trading is coming out soon in Overlook Bay. They actually posted this and said, here's a sneak peek of what our trading screen will look like in Overlook Bay. There will be a value meter that lets you know if it is a good trade or not. We have so many ideas to help to stop scammers. Oh my goodness. And I actually replied to this um, a couple days ago and I said, this is so legendary. Thank you so much for keeping the community safe. Together, we can change Roblox. And I still agree. You guys, we have the power to change Roblox and get rid of scammers and all of that. So I'm really excited to see where this goes. Now, some people were like, wait, why does it say that you have to pay money to accept? This is totally just random. They actually said to ignore the gems on the accept button. They were just messing around with that concept. So it's just gonna be super fun. Now this right here is the trading value thing they have. So this is a fair trade right in the middle. And then they have like a bad trade, an awful trade, a good trade and an awesome trade. Obviously it's okay if trades aren't the best. This is just to help people out and see how much their items are worth and to prevent scamming. Because if we have a value system automatically put in place, that helps people know. Because I've seen people that they see someone who's new in the game and then they lie to them about a value of an item. This is to help stop that. So even if you're new to the game and have no idea what anything is worth, you can at least see how much it's worth down here, which I think is so awesome. Now getting back to the fishing update, this I believe has something to do with it. Look at this! They tweeted this out a couple days ago and I just thought I needed to share it with you guys because it is just so cool. They said, who's ready to set sail? We're working on many fun updates for November. <gasps> this is such a cool idea. Look at, there's like a boat right here. I don't understand. So this area is the fishing area that's currently in Overlook Bay. Let's go to the beach. That is the area in the beach. As you guys can see, we have over here, we have barnacles bait. And then this is where you can sell your fish and your shells. So that's right there. That means the boat would be right here at this docking station. Oh my gosh, let's go look. You know what? I'm gonna pull out my UFO from the Halloween event and let's go drive oh my gosh oh my gosh <gasps> did they change the animation it literally looks like i'm driving this that's so cool oh my goodness gracious if you guys haven't seen my latest videos talking about all of these updates where they actually added some stuff to the inventory including a search bar and favorites make sure you check the videos out okay so here is where the picture shows that the boat is gonna be you guys here i'll put this side by side so that you guys can see it look it do you see this this right here is the sign and we're at the sign so a boat is gonna be right here oh my gosh this is gonna be so cool i wonder what's gonna be in that boat i've heard a couple theories let me talk to you guys about those theories really quick one of them is that this is going to be a trading pathway we know that trading is supposedly coming out in november again that is not confirmed but this update also is confirmed to come out in november so that would be perfect timing you guys know how in royal high you have to go to the ufo to get to trading this is what we think they're going to be doing as well it might not be the case so if it's not that's all right but this is actually a really good idea so many of you guys are so smart and came up with these cool ideas which is so awesome so there already is fishing in the game you guys may know if you want to fish you could just click here and get your fishing pole out and just go fishing so i'm wondering what does this fish and what does this boat, what does all of this have to do with the fishing that's already in the game? Like this little guy, what does he have to do with it? I don't know. What do you guys think? Make sure to leave me a comment down below and tell me how you think this all ties in together. The next thing I would like to talk about 
is the next part of the Halloween update. Oh my gosh, wait, I need to quickly fish. Oof. All right, ooh, cool, I got an uncommon. So the next part of the Halloween update is the final part, you guys. I'm so sad, the Halloween event is literally almost over, which makes me so sad because this was the best event that I have ever experienced, and that is not a lie. I'm sad that it's leaving, but I'm also a little bit excited because that means we're getting closer to Christmas, so I mean, hey. So a lot of you guys are wondering, what's coming out next week for the final part of this event? Well, we have two time souls that are going on next weekend. So starting on Friday, we are going to be getting two time souls. Everyone's going to get it the entire weekend. And the reason they're doing this is so that everybody has a chance to get whatever they would like to get. If you guys weren't able to get the vehicles, the pets, buy pet pods, get the house, you can do so and make sure that you go save up. Um, I am going to be saving up all of my crystals and then when it's two times, I'm going to sell them all. I definitely recommend doing that because that just gives you like that extra net of safety if you want to buy some stuff. And a lot of people have asked me if the two times souls weekend is going to stack with the two times souls game pass. The answer is yes. So if you are someone who owns the two times souls game pass and you are playing next weekend when there are double souls, you will get four times souls for the weekend. That's crazy. Like what? That's literally 400%. That's crazy. Oh my goodness. So I'm not sure what else is coming out for this event, but a lot of people have asked um, what is going to be happening. They asked a really nice question, and they were asking, Cutesy, are the souls that we have left over going to turn into gems? The answer is no. The gems that you have right now are gems, and the souls you have right now are souls. They're expecting everybody to spend their souls in the game with this two times weekend thing so make sure you spend all your souls up guys this is gonna be so cool i am going to go on a shopping spree with some of the cutesy crew this is gonna be so much fun i literally love this so much okay another thing i wanted to show you guys that wonderworks studios tweeted they said so many people have been decorating their spooky haunted houses you're all so talented share your haunted houses with us this actually ties into something that I'm doing. I noticed I was going to tour this person's house right here. I contacted them on Discord. I'm not sure if that's still happening or not. I assume it is if they're okay with it. I'm actually touring your Halloween houses. We are going to be doing it before this weekend because that's going to be perfect timing. So we're going to, I'm going to tour some of your houses. Again, you have to make sure you check out my community tab or my community posts to see the rules and how you could do that. We're probably going to record on Wednesday, I would say, just to be safe. Um, that is not guaranteed. If you guys are excited to see these updates, make sure to smash that like button in the face. If you guys want to be part of the cutesy crew, make sure to press that red subscribe button. Click that bell to get all notifications for the channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope some of this tea was useful to you. Big thank you to Wonderworks Studio for sharing some of this tea with us because they are seriously the most awesome team of devs and builders and scripters and everybody that I could have ever imagined. So thank you so much to them for sharing this with us. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Bye guys!